three teens beat father into coma. In an assault that left a father unable to speak, swallow, or think, a gang of teens was sentenced to prison. As an 11-year-old child was being tormented at Longcroft Park in Worthing on Easter Sunday last year, Alan Wilson raced to his aid. Alan, 47, was whacked by the sons, now 14, 15, and 18, with a three-feet log. In addition to breaking his ribs, fracturing his skull, eye sockets, and jaw, they left him with a brain injury. Annie, the care worker's distraught wife, claims that her husband has lost all mental ability and is unable to move. Hove Crown Court handed down its verdict today, convicting the group of miscreants responsible for all of this suffering. According to The Sun, the 14-year-old grinned as the decision was read out. The newspaper also said that the 15-year-old has a history of violence. It is illegal to identify these two kids who were convicted of intentionally causing great bodily damage since the law protects all minors' identities. As for Harry Furlong, 18, from Horsham, he was convicted of inflicting severe bodily injury without intent. Furlong has been detained in jail and the two lads have been held in a juvenile correctional centre until July 1. After a 14-day trial, horrific facts about what happened to Alan were exposed. During an argument over a frisbee, the lads allegedly caused a little kid cry by shoving him over. Those who heard the assault...